this whole world stop getting me down and people are Hey guys, thanks for joining me. Another rainy day here in the Carolinas. I thought I would take the breadboard out and kind of expand on a little project that I put together before. So it's kind of a multi-purpose, uh, close proximity AM transmitter. In addition, a ferrite antenna booster, kind of all in one. Again, leveraging the local oscillator of the receiver itself, that being in this case that I'm showing, the little transistor radio in close proximity to the uh, ferrite antenna that I've wound and transmitting the signal back to the uh, RCA Victor. So uh, pretty cool. Just again, sniffing out the oscillator frequency modulating the carrier you can see i've got a tuned circuit there across the uh, ferrite antenna so a simple design and just a diode to uh, modulate the carrier itself and again the same process here just leveraging the rca vector local oscillator in this case and transmitting and modulating the signal back to the little transistor Americana receiver. As you can see in here in the uh, demonstration the local oscillator of the old tube RCA Victor is a lot stronger in amplitude thus the uh, signal is a little stronger and uh, close proximity back to the uh, ferrite antenna is not as critical as it was using the uh, little solid state receiver local oscillator. And another way to use the uh, circuit itself, again, I'm just using my RF signal generator, a CW carrier unmodulated. And you can see in close proximity to the uh, ferrite antenna, I'm able to uh, generate a carrier being modulated back over to the uh, receiver as well. I also uh, took uh, three turns of magnet wire on the ground side of the uh, ferrite and have that attached. And I have two direct connection points as well for that coil. You can see in red and black. Hook those up to the signal generator and uh, transmit the uh, signal that way. Also, just varying the RF signal generator amplitude and frequency and also tweaking the uh, capacitor there as well on the uh, tune circuit back to the uh, ferrite antenna. And as I mentioned earlier, just using the circuit for a uh, ferrite antenna uh, booster in close proximity to the existing uh, receiver. You can see adjusting the uh, variable capacitor again, which uh, creates a uh, tank circuit there resonates across the entire um, AM band using the uh, ferrite antenna and adjusting for the uh, highest amount of um, signal strength so it comes in handy as well kind of an all-purpose uh, again close proximity AM transmitter you can see the uh, battery is uh, not in use when this function is used in addition to the uh, Bluetooth receiver has been removed. And in closing, a look at the simple schematic. Again, nothing more than a JFET amplifier with a uh, tuned input uh, source there using inductor uh, L1 and capacitor C. And you can see the L2 option as well for the RF input from a RF signal generator if needed. Again, modulation taking place through the uh, germanium diode, D1. And uh, just a short uh, wire antenna. I used uh, Litz wire, some left over after winding L1. 
Appreciate you guys watching. Everyone out there, take care. Stay well.